What's up, YouTube? I'll just be showing you some of my best baits right now, and what you can, where you can use them, and what you should, and what you should catch with them. Just go one by one. I'll try to make this pretty quick. It might take a little bit though. Okay, this bait right here, it's really good. Use it in pretty big water. I mean, well, use it in small water if you want to catch bass like crazy with it. This bait right here, it's big. As you can see, just looks like an ideal shad. And I catch striped bass with that in the Buffalo River. This bait is really for everything. Pike, and I've caught pike and walleye with it. This bait is the same as the first one except for purple instead of black. This bait, kind of same deal. Bat, all kinds of bass. And this bait is just really fun. It looks really good in the water. This one, my favorite bait overall is a popper. And I catch largemouth bass right like crazy with this. They go they go ham for it. They'll they'll do anything to grab it. Um this bait is just like uh I cat I caught a pike with it in Canada once. That's all I know. <laughs> This is a squid, largemouth bass like it. I've also caught bluegill. This is one of my other favorite baits, is, and I rig it, just Texas rig over the top, just swim it over the top of the water, get that twisty tail right there moving like that, and you'll just, and they go crazy for it. Also, you can fish it under the water with um, just every like 20 or 30 seconds, just move it around a little bit. And I'll go slow, cause and just use it with a plain non-weighted hook, a white jig, and then instead of jigging it, just swim it. I like doing that. And lakes for bass. This is my favorite, one of my favorite striper baits. It's a Cordell Redfin, and I use it in the Buffalo River as well. Um, this is my fa one of my favorite bass baits. It's pretty good. Uh, and one of the third to last bait is this, and I use it, it's, as you can see, it's a deep diver. It doesn't dive as deep as you would think, because it looks pretty, and I don't like deep divers personally, but I've caught a few good small mouth in Lake Michigan on this, on a tour. This is just a big old bait that I use for musky fishing, and I've hung up I mean, I've got, I, it tends to get hung up when, a lot, but I hung about a 25-pound muskie. Didn't really fight at first, and I thought it was just a bait until I got it up to the water, and it boom broke my line right as we were getting the net. This is still in the box, Strike King. It just bubbles the top of the water, and if you can take it over a bass's nest, they'll just fucking hop out of the water and get that shit. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and here are my baits and this one, but my baits mostly.